today is the fifth day of our walking, sixth day of our pilgrimage. We're leaving Albergue of uh, uh, Padres Re Reparadores, Reparadores, and uh, we're going. Oh, oh, what's our destination, Alice? Going to Estela. Estela. We're going to Estela. We're starting a little bit late. It's uh, four minutes after seven. Yesterday, I received a special pilgrim's uh, blessing at uh, Church of St. James, um, Iglesia uh, de Santiago. That was the church that I'm showing here. This is the bridge. It was built to help the pilgrims cross the road, cross the river safely. It was built by a queen and it's called the Queen's Bridge. Today Alice told me an interesting story, one of the pilgrims shared with her, um, he was um, doing the pilgrimage because all of his siblings have made it, so he wants to do it too, and uh, he was starting on the same day as we did, and it was a rainy day, and we had to cross the Pyrenees, the hardest day of the pilgrimage, so he decided to take a um, to hitchhike through the Pyrenees to spare himself the trouble of walking in the rain. So he did that. A French lady picked him up in a car, drove him over to his destination, and as he was getting out of the car, his pilgrim shell that was securely attached to his backpack somehow got loose, fell to the ground and split in half. So he took it as a bad omen and he decided to hitchhike back to the starting point and then walk through the rain. So he was back at about 10 o'clock in the morning and walked through the Pyrenees in the rain. Interesting story. It's getting warmer it's only 8 30 but the temperature is rising it's getting to be really hot There's some beautiful church ahead of us just um, refilled our water bottles in a drinking fountain and we're passing through the streets of a small village, very typical of Spain, just pavement and walls, it's actually very beautiful. Some pilgrims stopping by for a snack. 
in the local bar. There's an albergue. Mark that it's 8:45. Oh, here's the sign right like there. Hola. Buen camino. Buen camino. I could not ride the bike on those steep hills. I admire these people. by a small cemetery a refreshing reminder of our mortality and uh, this amazing mountain line ahead of us we're gonna be climbing all these mountains today First vineyard of a significant size in our way. Look at that city ahead of us. another vineyard and I'm getting closer to the beautiful city located so picturesque between the mountains I think up ahead of me. So I come to a crossroads. Alice is way ahead of me, and there's like four, three options to proceed. And I'm looking for the sign. Oh, here's the sign the arrow and the shell. And okay. right. I'm on the phone. Yeah. I just thought, I always try to remember people's names. Um, and it's hard to, you're Alice. Okay, yeah. okay. But I, I know how I remember your name. 
Alison. No, Alison. Oh, wow. <laughs> you were nearly there. <laughs> Alison Camino land. Had you thought of that one? I love it. Yeah, Alison Camino. <laughs> It's a good one, isn't it? Yeah, it is. <laughs> not, not a big boat, but we've got a big boat. Yeah. We're going. And, um, and it means that uh, that's where some of the pilgrims used to end up, yeah. <coughs> going back in medieval times. Yeah, uh, yeah well done. <coughs> this is such a delicious <coughs> snack. We bought it here. Mm. Yeah, we call it a guilty pleasure. I know. You can say that's it. what I do every once in a while. Maybe once a day. Where next? We're going Into the mountains. We passed the dreamy city. And we're looking for another yellow arrow. Do you see the arrow? Do you see the arrow? the beautiful city of Maneru with its splendid arches and delicious um, croissants very reasonably priced I really like Basque country and here is another um, olive patch olive tree patch beautiful bridges
There's a yellow arrow marker. Beautiful scenery as again as before. again and we need to look for the marker that's the road to take here's our guide yellow arrow and the shell we're almost at our destination the city of Estea and going through another awesome bridge But thankfully today we have a tiny bit of a breeze. So we're in the city of Estea, we walk up the stairs and we're going to St. Michael the Archangel Church for a 7 o'clock mass. Thank you. 